All righty, everybody. Mark, Five Angels Outdoor, and we are on the trail with the Bronco Raptor. So today we've met up with one of our buddies and uh, we're hitting citrus wildlife management area. So it's a good first test. There's some sugar sand here. There's some water. There'll be some mud. Um, there's a couple trails that have some decent off camber stuff so or uh, flexi stuff. So uh, we'll take you through that. We'll see how it goes. But uh, thanks for joining. And uh, as always, uh, we appreciate your watching. So uh, we'll see what this uh, Citrus WMA has in store for us. Starting to, rain, starting to rain a little bit here at Citrus. We're on uh, Trail 15. So we'll see what Trail 15's got in store for us. Looks to be a fun day. Yeah, I put the uh, Bronco into off-road mode just to just test out the setting. Off-road mode is pretty much four high rear lockers with uh, traction control off. So pretty straightforward, no big deal there. I mean, this is, I mean, right now what we're doing like could easily do in two-wheel drive, so. But we'll see what's in store for us. I think there's some water or something coming up. Yep, here we go, got a water puddle. Man, took that fast. Woo! This trail's wet. Water puddle coming through. We just came through 
a massive water hole back there. I didn't film it because I was focused on the road, but uh, it got pretty deep, but uh, we'll see what that looks like from the iPhone footage from, uh, because it, uh, it was pretty fun, but we didn't have any problem. Trail 18, I think it is. I think we're on trail 18 right now. So, see what holds us for. It's been a while since we've been to Citrus. Um, really, we've been hitting so many other spots and everything like that. Um, I, man, I'd have to think it's been at least a year since uh, we've been here. So, we'll just have to see what the trails are like. Um, they sure can change. And uh, so we will see. Taking the bypass here. These must be, these must be some pretty deep holes. If Christian's uh, bypassing them. It's like there's a bypass for the bypass for the bypass here. Looks like we got a little interesting challenge here that we're deciding on. Ah. Oh, he's got it. There it is. I'm not getting too crazy. That is some washed out stuff right there. Big time. Here we are, We're, this is just some slick Florida swamp mud. So it's wet, we're sliding around. now so we're gonna go through three water holes they're not necessarily too deep but the last one we will skip because it is a beast and a monster and it eats trucks so this is trail 11 at citrus wma little tight Plenty of uh, growth here. Now we have uh, off camber section. This is a lot. Uh 
uh, steeper than it was last time I was out here. I don't know if I'm going to be able to make this. Roger, I'll hang back just in case. So this, this hole here, we are bypassing. This is the infamous Trail 11 truck eater. This thing is so deep, many a truck has uh, been swallowed by this hole for recovery. Here is another truck eater on Trail 11. So, couple massive water holes. Probably need 40s to get through. But, uh, but yes, this is an eater of trucks as well. Some more water coming up in front of us right now. We'll see what Christian's going to do. This thing looks massive. Now, yeah, this is a big water hole, so we're skipping most of these. It looks like this area's got gotten a lot of rain. But we'll we'll catch some of it on the bypass. One rule of thumb for Florida, if you see water that has green algae on it, um, it's probably something you don't want to do. Uh-oh. All right, it's starting to rain pretty hard here. Um, we're heading over to the Trail 14 Trail 14, obviously, if you've been to Citrus before, you know uh, you know what it's like. It's washed out, a lot of off-camber, a lot of flexi type things. So we'll see what it's like today. We haven't been out there in a little while, but, uh, but that's pretty much where we're heading right now is we're gonna shoot over to Trail 14. Looks like we got some muckety-muck sand here. Sugar, wet sugar sand. <laughs> so it's different. But uh, definitely the rainy, rainy conditions make it a little crazy for sure. But we'll catch up to you. All right, so trail 14 in the pouring rain. This uh, should definitely be interesting. The main washout area will be coming up pretty soon, but even this little washout area is a little flexy. This is definitely downward flex right here. We'll uh, see how he, what line he takes. But uh, pretty interesting, nonetheless. Having to film from inside the car makes it a little interesting. But uh, it's raining pretty hard. All right, we should be coming up into the main flex area of Trail 14 here pretty soon. Hit the main flexi spot. Oh my, look, there's somebody else's crazy enough here. 
Someone in a uh, Forerunner is crazy enough. Oh, nice. And there's some ATV people here too. Interesting. Maybe it's, yeah, I don't know. But he's definitely in the uh, no vehicles beyond this point area. I can see the sign on the tree. And he's there. Yep, that was uh, quite easy. Easy. All right, everybody, that is it for our ride. We're over here, we did citrus over here with Luchucci State Forest. If I can get that out of my mouth, little tongue twister, but the rig did great. I mean, it was raining, uh, so it made some of the sugary sand goopy. Um, some of uh, Trail 14, which is really just your pretty high incline articulation, ruddy washout that made it a little more fun. Super slippery, super muddy up over there. Um, but yeah, we, we hit a decent amount of water. Um, we had a, a good little climb uh, that the truck did that handled really well. The Raptor did great and um, I've just been super duper happy with it. Um, but yeah, walking around the rig, obviously, um, you know, it's dirty. It finally got dirty. Um, we build up some mud here for sure, but, uh, but yeah, nothing too crazy. I mean, it's not, it wasn't overtly muddy. It was just more water and everything like that, so. I think it's looking good, but don't forget, stay tuned and uh, we'll continue to get out on the trail more. So thanks for joining, like and subscribe, and we appreciate your watching. We'll catch you next time while we're riding.